And there's also this DVD, Wicked Lake. Uh, what's, what's that about? Uh, well, I, I know this director in El Paso, Texas, where I live, and I love. Um, it's an old friend of ours. He's done a couple of ministry videos, and it's his first feature film. And it's basically just a little old story about lesbian vampires and things like that. And that old thing. It, yeah. That old thing. That it's old bag. Kind of like uh, Charmed on anabolic steroids. Okay. All right. So it's, it's it's right up my alley, actually. Basically like that, and I did the score for it, and I'm doing a lot more scores. I can't mention which right now, but I'm in the process of doing other things, and that's basically what I'm going to do now. It's just film scores and doing a label and producing knuckleheads like this. Yeah. And, and uh, basically chill out. I mean, as far as like the touring and being on shows like this. Huge Dave Navarro okay. extravaganza you, and all this Six stuff. or seven people are going to see this. <laughs> best. <laughs> Don't worry. Let's move into the world of politics, because I know you're very uh, opinionated when it comes to the... You think? Well, yeah, from, from what I understand. Uh, what is your stance right now in terms of... Who are you voting for? Are you an Obama guy? Obama. Yeah, Obama. Sure. Yeah. Obama. Obama. That's what I'm that saying. That was the biggest clap I got out of all seven. I know, it's for some, for some other guy. <laughs> um, did you see today that McCain's trying to postpone the, the, debate. uh, the debates? Yeah. We thought to, to address the uh, Wall Street problem. Well, that's, that's a nice angle, but basically McCain has nothing to say to the debates. That's what I think. The same thing as keeping Palin from the press, keeping McCain from the debates. Because when you're absolutely that senile, he's gonna it's get hard hammered. to debate. I know, he, I'm senile. He's going to get hammered. Like, First of all, if anybody's been watching this guy, it takes him about a half an hour to put a sentence together anyway. Because I have been, uh, I've been following, you know, this is a historical election. I haven't, I've never really been a It's a hysterical yeah, election. Yeah, that too. But I, I haven't been, I have never been really po politically motivated and I've, I've never really followed that. that you going to vote this time? Yeah, Good. yeah, absolutely. And, and it's just, uh, to me, it's just so clear as to which way we should go well for you and there's other people that think it's clear of another way we should go but i'll tell you what we shouldn't go is what we've been to that's what i'm saying for the last eight years and i know mccain is supposed to be bush and all that mccain's not bush uh he potentially is worse than bush he's got a hot wife he got it no, she's amazing she's amazing i, I think that cause i think that and she's should, like a gazillionaire and she's should, hot we should drop michelle get cindy in there and obama. with obama that that's the awesome. ticket that's that the is ticket. the that is the dream ticket let me tell you something we have a name for that in texas when you're that rich and you're that hot and you're that old you're prune tang <laughs> I like that. like that one. Yeah, but I, I really, you know, because I've been counting on this debate for a long time, and you know, the thing is that we have a government in place, albeit not a, a, an effective it's one. Not a government in place. But I mean, so McCain's going to go and, and, and get away from this debate, get away from what's going on right now, with the, where the country's going to go, to go assist people in what they're already doing? Th this whole thing's ridiculous. I mean, look, Obama and and uh, McCain both, and the government pushing through this $700 billion bailout, which is basically, to me, in my uninformed opinion, but it's a cash grab, a giant cash grab. Cheney's got all, he's, all the money he can get for Halliburton, not a, mm -hmm. a rat. Mm -hmm. Now, they're trying to figure out, well, we only got a couple months left. How are we going to get a lot more money? Let's do it off Wall Street. They're making all their friends money. I don't even think Bush is making money. I think he's too stupid to even make money. Here's the funny thing. He's got his nice little Crawford ranch. He's got solar power. He's got wind power. Yet he votes against it. He vetoes against it. God, I didn't know. Yet he's got that. Yeah. So he's going to go back to his ranch. He doesn't care. He's made all his friends money. All his friends in Wall Street, the oil industry, and the service industry. Uh, whether it be... Uh, um, Halliburton, Bechtel, Blackwater, uh, all these people that are basically in the certain... You, you destroy a country, you need someone to build it again. That's what Cheney's gig is. Right, right. I mean, I have this picture of Cheney basically dressed as the penguin in Batman, shoveling money into a Brinks truck <laughs> and telling Bush, just stall him until I'm done, and just shoveling money. Yeah. And that's what that's about. And I think that's what this bailout's about. 
is, uh, and they're going to curb the CEO uh, golden parachute to 400,000, uh, which is the cost of having a president. Isn't that what they say? Yeah, that's what it costs to pay the <laughs> commander in chief. Commander in chief, whatever you want to call it. Well, uh, it makes me sound like I know what I'm talking about. He, to go yeah, with yeah. A synonym yeah. to not just say the president every time. You know, oh, the commander but the in point chief. is, I really that, follow this stuff. They'll go for it because the 400,000 is only part of the bailout process. The process, the the key part of the process, is in determining what these uh, faulted mortgages are worth. Yeah. Who's in charge of that? That's the key thing, and whoever's in charge of that. You know the golden parachute guy that's down to 400,000 is going to make a ton off that as well. Right. So they can spin it all they want. Basically what we're doing is we're paying for more rich people to get richer. Same thing as what the Iraq war was about, what Cheney's all about, what this administration's been all about. I just don't <laughs> want people to just get all... Sarah Palin hunts moose. Yay, we're yeah, going to vote I McCain. Know. It just came out that she's had it in a, in a, an affair with, with her husband's business partner. Yeah. And like, for me... Who as, was a moose. As, yeah, as a voter, I don't... I personally don't give a f*** about that stuff, but does that affect... I do. Interbreeding is bad. Moose, <laughs> human vagina, not good. Human vagina no, and no, moose no, doesn't, go to, no, no. doesn't go together good. Not good. Um, but we've had, you know, we've had one president survive all of that, and uh, you know, we, Edwards just went just disappeared after that whole thing came out. You think that's going to affect uh, her standing? Because well, she's so popular right now. I mean, now. To, to to a lot of people it will, but I mean, would it affect that to you, uh, the ability for a person to govern if they've had an no. affair? No, I give a. F I mean, come on. They uh, let me do this show. You should see what I'm up to. There you go. I was gonna see? say you should run for president. Your ability to govern. Now exactly. govern, damn it. Govern, goddammit. Uh, so what else? What's going on with you? I feel like we, we haven't heard enough from you. What's going Come on, on down there? Uh, Chime in, dude. I don't know. I'm just uh, living day to day. I got to vote uh, before I go on tour, so I got to go down to Norwalk and vote there at the uh, election official. That was my right, that's service. part of our yeah. label. Our label. Every, that's it. That's all that's I got to right. say. Every band member has to show a voter registration. Oh, card. that's great. Yeah. No, seriously. That's great. On our label, you don't get on our label if you don't vote. Yeah, I got to vote. <laughs> nice. Way to go. Wait till the last minute. Are you like Prius owners? I mean, are you that? Do you go that far? No. Yeah. I own a Dodge Challenger. Yeah. And I, I like burn gas like a maniac. Yeah. But I don't drive it. Yeah. Well, that's that's my thing. Is I, I have a Hummer at home. Yeah. But I basically go from my house to 7-Eleven to get a pack of cigarettes and back. And that, and that's it's, it. It's all good. I know, relatively, <laughs> it's not a good thing to do, but uh, uh, everyone should do what they can. I remember like when uh, <coughs> Paul and Linda McCartney, when they did a, a tour 10 years back or whatever, where none of their roadies could eat meat and oh, all wow. this stuff, and they were real vegan and this and that. And they, and, and I, did a, I did a PETA record, really? actually, yeah. Uh, I, I, Put it together and did some score work for it and all that and uh, and and even within PETA they were all just like well no we have to be if if you wear any leather if you've ever done this if you've ever you can't be in this and you can, everyone has to be pure and all yeah. this and it's just like look everyone should do what they can yeah yeah I'm that's with it you on that and they try to make it sound like if you do what you can it's not enough and you're not good enough to be in this movement. And that's been the problem well, with the left basically, that's for what years. Basically, that, that kind of fanaticism yeah. turns into Al-Qaeda right. at the end of the well, day. Or, the, or Pat Buchanan or the right wing at the yeah, end yeah, of the day. Yeah. It's the same thing. Which is potentially yeah. more damaging yeah, 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 exactly. in the long run. But you know what I'm saying. It's yeah. just like do what you can to make the world, leave the world a little bit better place than what you came into. Yeah. That's, 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 that's such a simple theory, man. Look at that. Are there any uh, like websites or MySpace pages that you guys want to throw out there for yeah. projects you're doing? Because MySpace slash Prong, 13th Planet Records, yeah, Ministry, MinistryMusic.org. Yeah, oh, .org. You got an org? Yeah. How did that happen? I don't know. People don't. Yeah. I don't even use a computer. I don't use a cell phone. You got to get the. I, I get don't the use any. You started using a computer. Don't lie. No, I ESPN don't. ESPN.com. No, I don't. Yeah, that's another thing I was surprised to hear. You guys are like sports guys. Yeah, yeah he is. You're just sports I guy. Am, yeah. yeah. <laughs> how, how does? I mean, that's just that's. To me, Why that's really weird. Strange. Well, it's just a way to pass away the tour. Uh, when you go on, we make bets off tour. He always loses. <laughs> <laughs> 
Those drunken bets. <laughs> yeah, so. yeah. You know, you know the look. It's not like. It's a good way. It's a good, clean, fun way to pass well, time. Well, I mean, that, that, I am a hockey fan. Okay. Well, yeah, but you get to watch people kind of kick the shit out of each other during. during it's hockey. like WWF yeah. meets ballet. I can understand it's that. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful sport. Do I can't thank you guys enough for being here. I mean, it's, just, it. it's been a, a pleasure it's to been have a pleasure you, man. For me too. Yeah. Thanks, Dave. And Tommy, you're welcome, Nelson. Thank you you, you. you got to come down one night. I definitely will, Next man. Time. That sounds thank great. You. Let's hear it for Alan, Tommy. <laughs> it's a big day for us here, and we're gonna be back after this.